What's up guys, Exotic here and today we're fixing three annoying problems. The first problem will be having some PP filters that cause you orange screen. The second problem will be the reshade drawings causing uh, some patches or blurry textures going through the screen. The third problem will be having issue with the content manager when you try to install custom shader patch, either older or newer version. And I'll show you how to fix these problems. So let's jump onto the video. All right, guys, now we're in the game. As you can see, we have this annoying orange screen. So what we're going to do, we're going to start the game. Now we go here on all apps. You need to find post process filter. There we go. Post process filter. And you can see this happens with one of my PP filters as well. It happens with others as well. I face that. So whenever you find a PP filter that causes this, what you have to do is you literally just change it, change it back. And there you go you can see the game is perfectly fine and the filter is working fine as well now how to get rid of this completely is to start the game with a different pp filter which you can change in content manager okay so now you see that on a post-processing pp filters i'm running immediately on the filter that is causing me this bug this problem so what we're gonna do is we're gonna run the glare or any other PP filter that you know is not buggy. Let's see if the game will continue to start in orange screen, which is super annoying. Okay, and there you go. So the first problem, that's how I fix it at least. This is how you get rid of the orange screen. So you just run a different PP filter that works perfectly fine. And now you won't have the orange screen. What you can do now, the game starts in glare filter, but now I want to swap to the reshade filter. And there you go. So you can just switch manually to the filter that is causing the problem instead of launching the game with the filter that is causing the problem. All right, fellas. So the next is when you open the game, you might have like um, blurry lines going all through the game from everywhere uh, or your screen can be blurred. So what you do is you press home, you go to D3, D11, depends on the DirectX, if I'm not mistaken. You check all these drawings right here, the resolutions, and you check all of them till you hit the correct resolution with all the verticals and drawings and your so that your game will not be blurry or remove all the, the crappy things that you have on the screen. Alright guys, the third problem that I will share today is installing lights patch, basically the custom shader patch, either lower versions or the latest preview. So what will happen if I'm lucky here, it will not pop up, but yeah, of course. So my situation, it worked. However, when I was doing the no mods versus modded game version, this problem occurred here and it said could not find the file. So what you do when content manager says you couldn't find the file or file not found, is you would want to close content manager we terminate the installation you go find content manager i have it on my taskbar you right click you go run as administrator it will ask you you allow it and press yes so we're gonna run now content manager as you can see we're in administrator mode how to know if you're in administrator mode just to be sure is it will not allow you to drag the file so what we're gonna do is we go to these three lines here now we press install and we are looking for our where the hell is desktop we are looking for the lights patch so there we go lights patch we press we select it we press install and there you go now you have your lights patch you press install and it will go on so that's it gonna be guys today how to fix the three of the annoying bugs in the game Thank you very much for watching please like and subscribe i really appreciate it and if, if you'd like you can share the video leave your comments down below i'll make sure to check them out and the reason i do these videos is to help the community like i got help before either in forums when i was asking for problems and so on so i'm happy to share my knowledge with you wish you all the best guys see you in the next video